Hey everybody, I hope you're having a great day. Uh, it is Tuesday now? Yeah, yesterday was Monday. Today is Tuesday, January 12th, uh, 2021. I have a special guest with me, finally. I'm gonna get this special guest up and running. I'm not gonna say her name yet. I'll wait for the introduction. Uh, but first, I wanted to tell you how my day went. Uh, we had another great uh, homeschooling day. Um, I had to spend a little extra time on math and uh, <clears throat> we're working on some things with, with math. Uh, apparently uh, seventh and eighth grade is where I started sleeping because I don't know any of this stuff. Uh, they're doing exponents and things like that, uh, which, uh, aren't too hard. And I mean, it, it, I remembered some of it. And so it was handy, uh, having remembered that, but I've never used it. <laughs> I've never had to use exponents in any job I've ever had or any field that I've ever been a part of. Uh, but that's okay. You know, they, it's, it's good to learn and you never know when you might need it. <clears throat> uh, I didn't weigh in this morning. I think I am gonna do like the uh, the, the weekly weigh in um, because I just I just keep forgetting uh, or or my results may have just been really too high and I'm just a little too ashamed to share it. No, actually I don't even remember what it was. I, I think I think it was like four ten or something like that. So it's still still in the same same range. But if it's just gonna be consistent. Uh, or the same or plateauing, then it's not worth sharing. But if I'm losing, you'll be the first to know. I guarantee that. Um, what else is going on today? Uh, oh, quick shout out to my sister. She called me, she FaceTimed me, uh, Savannah, and uh, and I got to see baby Jojo, who is just a few months old, and I've, I haven't had a chance to, to meet him in person yet, but man, he is the cutest little baby boy I've ever seen. Uh, and, and I've got some cute little boys, but man, this kid, I told her she needs to call Oshkosh. She needs to call baby gap. She needs to, she needs to Jojo, man, you're, you're hot, baby boy. You're hot. And, uh, he needs to be, uh, a little baby supermodel. He is super cute. Got to see Skylar, got to see Camille and, uh, I miss them so much. And that was such uh, a treat being able to talk to my sister. We we were on FaceTime for geez, like over an hour and just having a good time. Just just being silly and making fun of how big her head is and just just you know poking fun at uh, at my baby sister. So that was a, that was a really good time. Uh also I noticed that a couple since I posted my video last night on on Facebook, I've gained a few subscribers. So thank you for that. I really appreciate that. Uh, let me know that you sub you subscribed and I'll give you a shout out here. Uh, one person that I don't know if they subs if they have subscribed or not, but I did have somebody text me and say, uh, my buddy Rob texted me and said, Hey, I saw your video. Uh, that's really cool, man. And, uh, and it opened up a, uh, a nice conversation for us to have. And we're just texting back and forth about life and, and I haven't talked to him in a while. And so that was really cool. Thanks Rob for giving me uh, a text and some encouragement and uh, telling me how your year's going so far and some things that are going on. And and uh, and so it's just really cool to, to, to touch base with people through this, through the through uh, YouTube videos. And so shout out to Rob for shooting me a text. I appreciated that. Uh, so I think those were the highlights of my day, talking to my sister, chatting with Rob. And uh, what did I eat today? I, I need to talk about that. Uh, so I got up, I had a Cliff Bar and a cup of coffee. I didn't even finish the coffee. I actually just found it in the microwave. I only drank about half of it, had to pour it out because uh, you don't want to drink skunky coffee. That's that's gross. Uh, I thought about it though for a second because I was like, oh man, I, I wanted my coffee. Uh, but I poured it out and <laughs> maybe I'll have one later. Uh, I had a Cliff Bar with it. Uh, white macadamia nut is like my number one favorite. And then the mint is, is my number two favorite. And so Cliff Bars are fantastic. I split a Cliff Bar uh, for like snack time with Tegan. Uh, cause she's been wanting to try the mint, uh, cliff bar. So I split one with her. It was like 250 calories a piece. And that's, that's a lot for a little tiny bar. And so I didn't mind splitting it with her. And maybe tomorrow morning I'll split another one with her because that's just a lot to add on. But however, I, I had 
the Cliff Bar and the and my coffee for breakfast. I did have. Oh, I'm using my phone. Daggone it, I can't even get on here. Once I get my camera, I'll be able to show you on my phone the app because I, I was doing it today. Uh, I, I charted, I put in, I say charted, that's what I used to do uh, <laughs> when I used to, when I was employed. Um, I, I put uh, the, the Cliff Bar in the notes, I put the coffee in the notes. I had a corn dog uh, because somebody made one too many corn dogs at lunchtime and I'm just not going to waste a corn dog and I haven't had one in a really long time. So I was like, I'm getting down on that corn dog. And so I looked it up after I ate it <laughs> and uh, it was only 190 calories for the Foster Farms. Uh, oh, Elise is trying to FaceTime me. I'm going to delete that because we're almost done here. Um, oh, and she's trying again. Hey, grab my laptop or my um, my iPad. And we'll see if we can FaceTime while we're doing this real quick. Grab it, grab it. She's going to call back probably. Uh, so I had the, yeah, here she is. All right. Let me see. Will this connect while I'm on my phone? Hello. Hi, I'm trying to FaceTime you. I know we're we're doing our 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 vloggy journal thingy right now with Tegan. Oh, well, I'm going to make it work. Love you, bye. Love you, bye. I think she hung up. Okay, we're good. Yep, she's gone. Okay, so that's like six and a half minutes. Ah, oh, man, I always feel so so rushed. Uh, sorry for the preachy video last night. Um, not sorry. I just had to, I had to get that off my chest. I, I believe that everybody, um, if you are a believer in the same faith as me, you know, let's, let's stay together. Let's stand together in love, in support of one another and just love on people, love on people we don't know, love on people we do know, especially, um, there I said it again. That's what we need to be doing right now. Um, Okay, I think Tegan, we were, oh no, dinner. Uh, so so lunch, I had the corn dog, 190 calories, and that's all I had was the corn dog. And then about an hour and a half later, I had half of that Cliff Bar with Tegan. So I'm at like 500 calories by dinner time. I still had like a thousand calories. Uh, Elise made biscuits and gravy, um, but I needed a little bit more protein than that. She did use um, sausage gravy, but the, it was like a, um, like a light or lean, uh, kind of sausage gravy. So it's not a lot of points. And I didn't use a whole lot of that. Um, I had two biscuits, um, which I probably didn't need two biscuits, but those are so flaky and good. I'm sorry if I'm like, you know, teasing anybody with the biscuits here, but man, if you like biscuits, uh, and gravy and breakfast type foods, that's the way to go. Biscuits and gravy can't go wrong. Uh, and it's so simple and easy to make, but I added some uh, eggs to it for the extra protein because I need to get my protein numbers way up before I have my surgery and just keep that protein going. And so I had um, I had three eggs with that, and that I haven't done the math on that yet, but I'm pretty sure it's under a thousand calories. So I'm ending my day on a really high note, not using all my calories. Uh, I might have some sherbet later. Um, or, or like a half a bag of popcorn or some pretzels with some hummus or something like that as a, as a snack before I go to bed. So that's it for food. Um, that's it for my shout outs. You got to talk to my wife for a second. So that's a treat. Now we're going to turn the camera over to, uh, my first baby girl, Tegan. Oh, it's a little shaky there. All right. You might have to get up on your legs on your, on your knees there. We'll go down a little bit. All right, so this is my Tiggy Bear. Oh boy, is that embarrassing when we call you Tiggy Bear? Kinda. Kinda. What about like out in public? Because you know this isn't public or anything, but you know if we're out at the store and I call you Tiggy Bear, I say, "Hey, Tiggy Bear, grab those diapers off the shelf. We need them for Jude because he's got diarrhea." Does that is that embarrassing at all? Is it? No, oh, I'm sorry to embarrass you. So now Tegan's going to pretend to be shy and quiet, but Tegan uh, is, is, is my, uh, she's, she's, well, you can tell, you can tell your age. Uh, how old are you? Nine. Talk to them. Nine. Talk to, talk to me watching this later to them up there. Ah, I am nine years old, right? Hey, let's pull the camera a little bit closer. Sorry for the jarring. All right. You are? Nine. Nine years old. What grade are you in? 
third, but fourth grade math. Fourth grade math, yeah, she's advanced in math. She moved ahead, she finished the third grade math book and said, forget this, I'm out, give me the next grade. And so she is doing fourth grade math, which is really impressive. What happened today in math class? Um, we struggled for a bit, right? But we came yeah. back around. We're, what I are we doing? What are we working do on? My math book, and then I had to do more multiplication on Math Master. Math Master is a, a fun app that we like to use. Uh, it's it's timed. You get uh, you know one star, two star, three star based on points and how many you get right or wrong. And so we're we're shooting for seven thousand five hundred points, three stars. That's a perfect score, hundred percent, right? Yeah. And for the first time ever, what happened? I got 7,500. 7, she got three stars. Three Go stars. you again. Uh, like a rock star. By the end of the day, I, I feel like we were, we were getting a little discouraged because we're doing multiplication and division. And some of it is, is uh, you know, for, for somebody in third grade, I don't remember doing it, but I guess I probably did. And it was probably... A bit overwhelming going from adding and subtracting to multiplying and dividing that that's tricky it's different and you got to remember all those additions and subtractions in order to do the uh multiplication and division so but you did great you finished the day strong and then we had after math what did we do um art art we had art class and what did you paint i painted a jellyfish mm. I split in half the Do you want to show piece. us? You want to get it? I didn't even think of this. Go, yeah, go get it. Go get it. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. So while she's gone, I'm going to say that she's back. Oh, where's it at? Oh, is it upstairs? Okay, forget it. Maybe we'll share it tomorrow if, if I remember. Okay. All right. So it's a jellyfish. But like the, the, the canvas, it's, so it's on a little uh, thin canvas, right? And the jellyfish, it's, it's like split down the middle and half the, the, the leg side of the jellyfish is like over here and then the head is like over here, right? And then you split it and then you made it like watery on one side and like, like flowing and then you colored the jellyfish different purples and pinks and blues and things like that. It's, it's quite beautiful. And uh, hoping to frame all of their artwork here soon. We've got a, a stairwell with nothing on it. We just painted it. And so we're going to tack up some of their artwork and have all that stuff so we can stare at it and say, oh my gosh. You're like, uh, who's a famous uh, artist? Uh, Leonardo da Vinci. Leonardo da Vinci, yeah. Oh, my battery is getting low. We'll wrap up here in a second. Uh, who Do you know another famous artist? Vincent Van Gogh. Vincent Van Gogh. Who, is that your favorite? Yeah. Yeah. What's what's your favorite painting by Vincent Van Gogh? Starry Night. Mine too. Oh my gosh. I love I love Starry Night. It's uh, one of my favorite pieces of art. And Tegan, uh, she's giving, she's got a cup over there. It's a, it's a tumbler with Starry Night on it. And uh, we love Starry Night. We love Vincent Van Gogh. And we're gonna watch that new Vincent. Well, it's not new. I, keep, I think it came out a couple years ago. They make the whole movie out of Vincent Van Gogh. Um, they recreated. They recreated the whole. Their paintings mm -hmm. and made it into the movie. And sometimes they had to like switch the seasons or make the art piece bigger and add more to it. How many artists did they have working on that? Do you remember? About three hundred. Three hundred artists. It took them a long time, and they had to they had to do it frame by frame and change the artwork to make it flow. It's beautiful. If you haven't looked it up, it's, is it called Vincent Van Gogh? Or is my, uh, my Love in Vincent. My Love in Vincent. My Love in Vincent? My Loving. Loving Vincent, that's right. And I think it's on YouTube for free, isn't it? Uh, I think it was, yeah, I think, I think it was, it was on YouTube for free. All right. Free or sold on YouTube. What do you want to be when you grow up? Probably, um, artist or a uh, marine biologist a marine biologist or an artist both both things that i that i just find completely fascinating and beautiful and i think you can do it tegan yeah i know you can mm. yeah i'm excited for you also tegan got what'd you get for christmas i got a camera what kind of camera i don't know what kind 
Yeah. It's a video camera, right? It's, video it's a video camera. camera. It does take pictures, right? But it's yeah. primarily it's a video camera, and you got the whole rig and everything, right? Yeah, you got the uh, the microphone and the, and the the rig to hold it. You got all the good stuff. So hopefully we're setting this girl off in the right road for success. We got art supplies. We got. Uh, Pick, you know, a camera for you to take pictures of, and uh, and and a dad who loves ocean life and uh, marine biology. So hopefully, we can inspire and uh, for the next generation, right, and get these oceans cleaned up and get the sharks taken care of and save the whales and and do all the important things that keep the environment moving, right? The life cycles going, right? So you're awesome, Tegan. Thanks for being on my journal vloggy thingy. <laughs> I'm glad we finally got you up here. So, uh, I love you. Love you too. <laughs> I was talking to them. <laughs> we love you guys, right? We love everybody that's watching. TT's probably watching. Uncle Johnny, Grandma, Grandpa, uh, maybe Mr. Rob now, right? Because he, he saw our, our YouTube channel. So, maybe he's watching. So, shout out to all you guys. We love you. We miss you. Have a blessed day. Uh, be kind to somebody. And uh, don't expect anything in return either. Just just be kind. Because it's the right thing to do, right? So, all right. We'll talk to you tomorrow. See ya. Bye. Bye.